Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. The world can be a very scary place. Villains can be larger than life. And almost impossible to defeat. The stress of saving the world can turn even the best of friends against each other. And not everyone will be on your side. Some will try to take advantage of your kindness. But a true hero will know exactly what to do. And will inspire others to do the same. But the scariest thing of all, even for the bravest hero, is discovering the villain is much closer than you think. Is this? Oh, uh, where's my stuff? A gauntlet! I hope Petra's okay wearing it. Gotta get back, find the admin, find my friends! The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check in zone. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check in zone. Hey, disembodied voice, where am I? The guest will kindly follow the oh, orange the line, line in the floor, floor to the, the check-in check zone. Yeah, I heard you. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone, or else they get the lava. The lava. Got it, point made. Oh, look, an orange line. Bedrock? The admin said. A place where I'd never see the light of day again. What is this place? So, Jesse, how was your day? Oh, it was great. Met a red, glowy, all-powerful, crazy person who trapped me in a near-indestructible cage. <sighs> Sure, this is leading me to a place full of sunshine and cheer. Sunshine Institute. It's a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. I'll be your warden. 
So the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. I'm sure we'll get along just famously. Maybe we'll even be, uh, friends someday. Yeah, I don't know if I'd call this place brilliant. <sighs> it is the most brilliant. Y you know he's not here right now, right? You never know. What about my friends? I need to get back. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, man, lucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. Yeah, you have zero idea what you're saying. Mind that attitude, Jesse. And if your friends are anything like you, They'll be making their journey to Betterment right next to you, I'm sure. Now hang on a tick. I have a... another guest on my manifest. Male. Grizzled beard. Hair is described as... majestic. Long, long list of aliases hey, distract here. Distract him. Yeah, that's Jack. Jesse, thank goodness I found you. This I place. Know. Let's get out of here. Wait, you can't. It's too dangerous. Stop them, associates! Oh, I can't believe what a mess we're in. And all because I didn't realize Foss was actually the admin. Oh, what a mess. Manipulated, shammed, ashamed. Don't give up yet, though, okay? You still got me, Nurm, Petra. Yeah. And now the admin has Petra, too. I... I don't know how we're gonna get out of this one. Hey, sound the alarm! Stand a chance without weapons. Can we run? Where? Wherever they aren't. Stop them! Don't let them reach the burrows!
Well, really wish I had that gauntlet right about now. Yeah, maybe not this way. Reaper? It's the stuff nightmares are made of. That was unsettling. Of course, why would there be only one? There's never just one. Oh no, oh no, oh no! Ended in an escape attempt. <sighs> that is just. That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. <laughs> and bring that one to my office. Now. Close the door, would you? Do as you're told. Go on. Uh, sure. Obedient. Good. You and your band of misfits may have hope yet. Band of misfits? Oh, let me show you. Radar! Nerm! You see, here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself and your punch-happy friend down there. And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be, uh, well behaved. Your friend, with the glasses, is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. You think you want to mess with me and my friends? You think wrong. You mess with me, and you mess with my friend. The admin. And that's something you definitely don't want. Bring up Jesse's leverage, would you? Skinny guy, glasses? Funny story. When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. Simpler times. No, 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 no! This place is filthy! Ah, oh, so disorganized! Ah, making me crazy! Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! I was so... Look, I was so worried! Oh, this place is terrible! Radar, I am so, so sorry. This is all my fault. What are you talking about? Meet... 
The Iron Breathtaker. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. <gasps> Now, I said before that you could follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Ready to improve that pesky bad behavior of yours and join the good guys? Work for me as an associate and help bring order to these poor, chaotic individuals. Don't do it, Jesse! <laughs> <laughs> What's it gonna be? I decide quickly. I hear it's excruciating in there. No freaking way, Warden. Go eat a slime ball. Oh, some people. Don't say I never tried to help. Oh, whoa. Long time in there. Feeling a little dizzy. Hey! Oh my gosh, Radar, are you okay? Oh, your eye. Jesse, is that you? Don't worry, I got you, buddy. <laughs> Knew you wouldn't give in. <laughs> Times get tough, get tougher. So come on, Radar, show me some tough stuff. Right. This is prison. Never show fear. Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Stella? W what are. How? Well, I appreciate you letting me out of that ice. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. Ah, you two know each other? <laughs> oh, yes. Our bitter rivalry goes way back. Yeah, still not your rival. Never was, never will be. Careful, Warden. This one's crafty with the mind games. Now come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I've barely arrived and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. <sighs> Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe... Readjust your concerns. There are bigger silver fish to fry than... than... friends. Jeez, have you always been like this? Always? <laughs> no. What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange, Jesse. Let's go, rival! That's right! Go along, Jesse, to the mushroom! Exactly what I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella. Would ya? Thanks. Excuse me? <laughs> Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? I need a moment to process. Maybe several moments. You have to watch your back with her. She's ruthless. Ta-ta, Jesse! I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive salt block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. <sighs> you okay, Radar? I wish I was. I need something to eat. 
get my strength back. <laughs> You're in the right place. Guests make mushroom stew here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. There's one. Mushroom! I'm gonna starve. Waste away. Poof. No more radar. You don't have anything in your inventory? You're usually so well prepared. Usually. Only I showed up here with no food, no goods, no nothing. Like everybody else. I saw Jack earlier. He might know what to do. Definitely not getting back out that way. That poor guy still looks pretty shaken up. Hey, are you okay, buddy? Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll be fine. Just a little hungry, that's all. not be looking at me. I, I hate to stare, but you're... Weird looking? Huh. Maybe you just need to get out more. This is what people look like where I come from. Noted. Sorry. How'd you get that bowl of stew there? I don't know what you heard. But you won't get any free food from me, fresh meat! Get out of here! Got any idea how to bust out of here? Hey, you're one of us. I can tell you. Really? No! So, what got you tossed in here? None of your business. Was it embarrassing? None of your business. What if I go first? There was this gauntlet. Stop it. All right, then. This was enlightening. Sort of. Not really. <gasps> hey, how's it going? Noticed you got a cookie there. Cookie? Uh, what, what cookie? That was just a wood slab. Crazy McCrazy thinking they saw cookies over here. Go grab a mushroom. What is that guy up to? Hey, are you busting out of here? <laughs> Everyone gives up on account of the mining fatigue, but they just don't got the patience. It just takes longer, see? Just a little bit at a time, mm-hmm. You just caught me putting the happy little finishing touches on my happy little painting here. What, uh, what you painting? I'd so love to paint a happy little mushroom, but none ever stick around long enough for me to paint. Do you think you could be so kind as to build me a happy little mushroom to paint? Here's some wonderful dirt for you to use. Thank you. 
just that is just lovely thank you ever ever so much please you must share your thoughts on my work so far don't you hold back now honesty's the best policy oh my gosh it's great it's the uh, chiaroscuro is just impeccable truly so happy you like it. And now, I like you. You'll be spared when the bad thoughts come. Look, I have something important to ask. Go ahead. Any idea how to get some food around here? Your best bet's the mushroom pit. That's where all the guests get their food. Interesting hairdo. Well, howdy howdy, friend. What can I do you for? Hey, so, what's your name, buddy? Three little letters. R-O-B. That spells Rob. That spells my name. You ever try to bust out of this place? Too busy painting. Can't quite work a canvas when you're trying to vamoose. <sighs> There is one person who tries to escape. Over and over again, really. Prisoner X. Who's that? Nuh-uh. I'm not saying anything more about her. So, how did you make the admin mad? No, oh, he didn't care for my painting, so I threw TNT at him. <laughs> he didn't care for that either. See you, buddy. I wish you happy painting, and I'll see you next time. Now. Jack! Nerm! Hey! Hey, Jesse. Man, I'm glad you're okay. When I saw the admin teleporter take, you know, it was, uh, well, it was, uh, I mean, I, I know I saw you at the entrance, but, uh, no, no, I, I was just, uh, it was... Aw, oh, was Big Tough Jack scared? Was he worried about little old me? Hey, come on. I'm having a tough time here. <sighs> After what happened with v not Voss, you know, and, and then Petra, and, uh... We're gonna stop the admin, Jack. I'm going to get us out of here. Yeah, yeah, I, I know you will. Oh, and, uh, you might want to get Slim over there something to eat. He's looking a little peaky. Yeah, I'm working on it. Thanks for looking out. Hang tight for now. I'll be back. Hey. those cells belong to. I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. It's a recording? Come on. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well... We'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion! As Jesse walked up to Brick, 
Jesse noticed that he was narrating all of Jesse's actions. How do you know my name? Jesse was surprised to learn that the reputation of the Wither Slayer, the leader of the Order of the Stone, had spread so far. Brick was curious what Jesse thought of someone who narrated every action around himself. Brick waited for Jesse to say something. What would it be? He wondered. Jesse approved of Brick and his quirks. Jesse winked with approval, like this. Brick was happy for the approval, but didn't appreciate Jesse stealing his thing. I mean, come on. It was his thing first. So, what are you in here for? Brick remembered the day the admin, annoyed with Brick's constant need to narrate, sent him to the Sunshine Institute to break Brick of the habit. Brick was promised release if he stopped, but nothing will ever break Brick's spirit. He will narrate forever. Ever try to get out of here? Brick knew that the only way out was through the burrows, a seemingly endless labyrinth filled with monsters and who the heck knows what else. Brick also knew that only one person has ever tried to escape, but Brick never speaks her name. But Brick will never speak of Prisoner X, so Jesse never asked again. I need to get some food. Any tips? Brick looked out on the mycelium field, knowing that at any time, mushrooms would pop into existence, and that all fellow prisoners would have to fight to get one. Brick hoped Jesse was a worse fighter than he was, but from the looks of it, Brick is in mondo trouble. That's it for now. Thanks, Brick. You're welcome. Er, uh, Brick told Jesse, you're welcome. One bland diet. That looks like the best spot to hunt for mushrooms if I want it in. Mushroom! Ugh. Mine! This one's mine! Not if I get it first! Roar! Just need a red one. Nice, I got him. Thanks for picking those for me, noob. Whoa! Nothing personal. I'm just mega, mega hungry. Ah, give me that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just so hungry. Uh, <clears throat> hello? What's going on in here? I should have known it was you causing more trouble, Jesse. Tisk. I say tisk. And just who does this contraband belong to, hmm? You all know that weapons are strictly forbidden at the Sunshine Institute. So who does this belong to? You might as well just come out and tell me. It'll be so much easier for everyone. Large Henry won't have to pummel anyone. No one will need to be pummeled. That guy attacked me with it! Hmm. What refreshing honesty. More like what a refreshing lie you mean, you rotten snitch! You know that misbehavior means getting sent down a level. And that means... No! Not the zombie mines! Not the zombie mines! Yes. Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten flesh will teach you something. Take him away. No more fighting. No more rule breaking. Any of you. Jeez, what a jerk. Uh, at least now I can make some stew for radar. Well, 
That's not much, but hopefully it'll help Radar get his strength back. Voila! One fresh bowl of mushroom stew. Thank you, Jesse. You have no idea how happy... I mean, psh, I guess I'll drink this slop. Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm gonna have to really step it up. I mean, this is prison. So from now on... I'm prison, Radar. I'm gonna get my own mushrooms. Make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Break whatever rules I feel like. Within reason! Um, whatever. Bro. Yeah. I mean, uh, whatever. Psst. Now step aside, Jesse. It's time for Prison Radar to show this world what he's made of. That's right. Come at me, dude. What's going Prisoner on? Prisoner X has escaped. I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped. All guests, please report to the nearest lounge. <laughs> Think that's their cute way of saying sell. Yep, and you definitely want to stay away from this. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder, Prisoner X. Other inmates were talking about her. Something of an infamous escape artist. Rumor has it she even knows the way through that maze. Most people have never even seen her, the Keeper locked up so deep. But everyone's heard of her. And man, do they talk about her. That sounds like the sort of person we should get on our side. Agreed. Someone with that kind of knowledge could be very useful. But where is she exactly? She's apparently locked up on the deepest, darkest level of this place. Cell Block X. Uh, detecting a theme with the names. Yeah, they found their groove and they're sticking with it. We need to get to Cell Block X. Those zombie mines are where troublemakers are sent, right? Seems to me you're already pretty high up on the Warden's naughty list. Cause some chaos? Might be exactly what we need. The Warden does hate my guts. Could use that to my advantage. Manipulate the man to work for us! Prison Radar votes heck yeah! Okay, it's a plan. You stay here and rest up. I'm gonna find a way to get us to cell block X. Sounds good. While you do that, I'm gonna study this place. Before we're through, I'll know it like the back of my hand. But how to get sent down to the lower levels? Hmm. Talk about suspicious looking. There's got to be something in here I can use to get into trouble. Oh, I know a secret door when I see one. See what I can do with this. I think there's another room back there, but how do I get in? That painting feels out of place. Secret buttons, nice. Now we're on to something. Okay, time to see what tall, red, and gruesome is hiding. Okay, looks like the buttons move the blocks. So that button moves. 
close that block. This moves those blocks. Got it. someone had been around to see me being this impressive. Hmm. Mm. A mushroom? What the heck are you doing here? Sounded me like I could ask you the same question. Yeah. Mind explaining what you're doing in my most private of spaces? Visitors ain't welcome, and you are most definitely a visitor, hence not welcomed. Just looking for cell block X, big guy. Well, it ain't here, short stack. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you regret getting in it. Who's this weirdo? Hey. Huh? Holy cow! A mushroom! We can feed the entire room! Hey, hands off! Sharing is caring? <laughs> what is going on in here? <gasps> of course, it's you. Anthony! Shears, this is your last chance to right some wrongs. You shear this mushroom, and I promise no pain will come to them. And if I don't? Then I can't promise to keep that promise. What? No! You don't do it, Jesse. Not liking your hesitation here, Jesse. You can't. You won't! You do want to be promoted, don't you? <laughs> I'm begging you. Go to the nether and jump in a lava lake, Warden. Yeah! Take it away! No! <laughs> Not my Jeffy! <laughs> you don't know to stop causing trouble, do you? Well, trouble has consequences, Jesse. Dig it up. What the heck are you doing? Teaching you a lesson, Jesse. No more mycelium. They'll starve! You and your friends will be relocated to the lower levels. The zombie mines. Well, isn't this a treat? My rambunctious rival is now my poor prisoner. Get moving. Well, we needed to go to the lower levels anyway. Let's hope they're survivable. Welcome to the zombie mines, Jesse. <laughs> oh, just when you think you've seen it all, what exactly is this place? Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the zombie flesh, which is... Gross, I get it, but why? Don't know, don't care. Do your job. Zombies won't fight themselves, so get to fighting. You never thought to question the admin? You don't question greatness, and he is the greatest. For now, at least. You brought this on yourself, Jesse. I don't get it. You could have just joined the admin and never had to suffer a second. Instead, you chose to throw it all in the lava pit. I think all of those people cheering for you 24-7 have made you delusional. Made you think that you can just uh, change the world. <laughs> it's sad is what it is. I'm a rebel. It's just who I am. So it would seem. But consider this a warning. Don't mess with the admin. You will not like the outcome. 
give you one piece of advice. Just one. Try not to cause any more trouble. If you do, you'll get sent to Maximum. With her. Who's in there? You must have heard those alarms earlier. That was Prisoner X. She tried to escape, but they got her back. And she... she scares me. You don't want to end up in there. So, play nice. Come along, Luna. What on earth was that about? Sounds like that vent is our way to Prisoner X. Such a brat, Luna! Come on! <clears throat> Ow! Luna, stop that! I'm hitting my llama limit, Luna! Knock it off! She's just not your biggest fan, Stella. I don't get it! I am very deserving of fandom. <clears throat> stop bothering me. Don't you see I have important business to tend to right now? has sun and shine in it. This place doesn't have either. Zombie and despair might be more accurate words. Hey guys. Hey. Found anything? <sighs> Nothing of use. Especially since I refuse to look away from those zombie spawners. Don't want any surprises when they go off. Hey. Keep your eyes open. Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall? Not sure why, but man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. Hey, Radar, are you okay? Mushroom. It was intense, huh? No kidding. Standing up to the warden, though? That's my Jesse through and through. Thanks, buddy. But those poor prisoners. No food? Rough stuff. And Stella? Here? We can't catch a break. But first things first. Let's find this Prisoner X and get out of here. zombie flesh somewhere. What could the admin want with it? Oh, hey! Uh, you want some? Fresh flesh! Wow, you really like that stuff, huh? Nah. Oh? I love it! High in protein, high in flavor, maybe just a little bit poisonous sometimes, but you only live once. You sure you don't want some? Plenty to go around. Just say the word. Yeah, no, I'm good. Your loss. Gotta be 
be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey, don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. Well, I'm... I'm trying to escape, dude. Plain and simple truth. Don't you want to get out of here, too? That's, uh, irrelevant. No one escapes. Especially not through that door. Hmm, so that redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. Hey, guys, over here. What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Hey, Jesse, stop loafing around. Well, there is someone in here who came from the outside who may still have a hefty inventory. Ah, oh, Stella. Now, Jesse, guests and associates really shouldn't be mingling. Yeah, about that. I, uh, need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why, exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. It's probably stupid. Why do you care? Just help me out, for, uh, old time's sake. If it's gonna risk my future as the admin's partner, I care quite a bit. Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. Not giving it up for you. But he's why you're down here, come on! And he is who will help lift me back out again once I finish helping him run this horrible, smelly mud pit. Maybe you make some good points but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. Um, you know, a power and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Many. Yeah, but what about Champion City? You're gonna abandon them? <laughs> Absolutely not. They'll be fine. They will be just, oh yeah, who am I kidding? I have done so much for them in the past, I mean, they can barely make bread without me supervising. Okay, look, maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Here's the cobblestone and stick. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero or whatever. That's not too much, right? Yeah, no. Big old no. Yeah, okay. That's it for us. No more rivals. No more anything. No matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Let's do this. Zombie wave incoming! Prepare yourself!
Prisoner X will escape! surprised admin it's not enough that you disregarded all the rules in my icy palace of doom tried to upset the delicate order of the sunshine institute now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine what gives pretty sure your fellow inmates were just trying to peacefully live out the rest of their captivities I've got it hard enough in here without nuisances like you gumming up the works Ugh. Well, after you came to Beacon Town and wrecked everything, it seemed like the least I could do. It's terribly rude, is what it is. <laughs> Edmund! Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I I'm j I'm j uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. No, not that. I'm disappointed that you can keep Jesse in line for one measly day! I was just trying to do my job, and now I'm in trouble because of you! This job isn't easy to begin with. Why do you have to go and make it harder? I had to get out of this prison. Nothing personal, Warden. Oh, sure, nothing personal. Just my whole reason for existence. Oh, for the love of... Enough! I'm through letting you disappoint me! And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially you. And as for you, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty. To prove your worth as my champion. your sword and attack Jesse. And as for you, Jesse, well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. No! I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion. You gave it. No, I can't. This isn't happening. <laughs> Serious ouch. Zip it, Jesse. We only got one shot at this. I'm going to go to the admin, and then we'll both attack him. Just trust me on this one. You're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh-oh. Oh, all I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore. And I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about... Prisoner X, what about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. 
and I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. This I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. What are you doing? This isn't how you make friends. Oh, I think I know what I'm doing. <sighs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all. Everyone loves Jesse, right? No. <gasps> no way. You coming? Good news, Jesse. You're not my rival anymore. Since you're gonna rot down here forever, you're nothing now. Coming, darling admin! Stella is just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry, I'll take good care of Beacon Town. <laughs> He's gone! Jesse, we gotta stop him! Oh, Petra. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. What? No. You have nothing to apologize for. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. I'm so glad you're all right, Petra. Hmm. Yeah, that was... That was pretty bad. After he took me away, I, I was in this weird place. Time and everything was so strange. I felt like I'd been there forever, and I started to worry you'd given up on me. Hmm. That sounds... That sounds horrible. Not to uh, be insensitive, but you're okay now, right? Not, like, under the admin's control? I mean, duh, of course, I'm, I'm okay. I'm, I've, I know that sounding this flustered is making it seem like I'm not okay. I promise, I'm okay. I saw Beacon Town, Jesse. They were all worried about you. No one knew where you were or if you were alive. I'm sure the admin's heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Identity theft is no joke. Admin will wish he had never even seen my face when I'm done with him. No one wears my face except for me. We made it. Wow. Some intense security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. Huh. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded Prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. All we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Ooh. Come on, I think we can make that jump. Oh. You're up next, Nerm. Oh. Okay, now you, Loon. Seriously, how do you do that? Uh. 
Last jump! I'm Jesse. You must be Prisoner X. <sighs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle! Do it, and you're stuck here. Forever. So this is a rescue attempt? Oh, how heroic. Look. Prisoner X. Zara! You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? Oh. No one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. And no one ever will. I don't have time for lies, Zara. I need to get out of here. Oh, are we supposed to be friends now? I don't owe you the truth. Or anything for that matter. The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, um, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? He would want you to think that. Of course he would. How do you know his real name? Oh, we're very old friends. I know his real name, and much, much more. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person. Except to put the Warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more Warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help Any me? enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I've never technically said that. But I think it sounds pretty good. How can I trust you know the way out? Oh, don't worry. I know the way. I'm the only one who does. If you know the way, then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom! <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. That's the only way out. We're all getting out of here. No one's staying behind. Oh, I'm afraid that's quite impossible, Jesse. One of them is going to have to stay. Oh, I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Hey. Hey. Uh, Nurm, no, you can't do that! Uh. Oh, come on! We seriously don't have time for this! I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same.
My straight jacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. Prisoner X, I presume? Yeah, guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. Where, uh, where's Nerm? Oh, your villager friend offered to take my place so my cell's booby traps wouldn't go off. <gasps> what? No. He... he did that? And you let him? Nerm did it to save us. You would have been proud of him. I mean, of course I, I would have been. I... I always am. <sighs> well, no matter what it takes, no matter how many heads I have to clobber, I will get him back. She better be worth it. Trust me, I'm worth it. Ugh, can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. Run for your lives! The guests have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yipes. Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back, and his front, and his side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. Not my friend, not my problem. I'm moving on. Well, all right. I never knew your heart had such icy tendencies, Jesse. Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! I could take the enchanted iron sword or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad, hmm. Okay, definitely feeling better with a sword in my hand again. Agreed. What? It's versatile. I don't know much about llama fashion, but that's a good look, Luna. Looking good, gang. Now let's... G-E-O-F-F. -F. That spells my best friend. <laughs> Love you, Jeffy. Friends reunited! It's a prison miracle! I guess Jesse does seem like good people. Oh, jeez. Uh. They're holding us up. Uh. Move along. Now. Rex. Oh, jeez. I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here. Come along, Jeffy. That was frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? The opening should be just around this corner. We have a situation here. Back! Back! All of you! One more step and it's Kaboomsville! Jesse! Warden, what's going on here? Hey! You're one of us! 
Help us beat up the Warden! It'll be a good team-building exercise! Plus, we beat up the Warden! Win-win! Well, dip my bristles. Look who it is. It's my happy little friend who took a look at my happy little painting. Jesse, you freed Prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore! What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's Prisoner X! I think you've clearly lost your mind. She is bad news. Actually, no, she is way worse than bad news. She doesn't deserve to be locked up. None of us do. Did you know she was once an admin too? The admin had to take her powers away. She tried to destroy him. I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what. And I'll keep that promise. Even if I need to blow us all up to do it. <sighs> Why are you all staring at me? It's making me uncomfortable. So is it true what he said about you? You were an admin? Well... Ugh. It's complicated. We want answers, Zara! Uh, fine! Yes, I was an admin. Ages ago, Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. But I'm not the villain here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here, not me! So glare in another direction! I'm innocent! You're just another victim of the admin, just like the rest of us. And there will be a lot more victims if he isn't stopped. Soon. She's not like us. She's a monster. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what do we... We don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Follow me. I'm... I'm sorry, Jesse. But do you really trust her? She's not right in the head. Jack, you haven't seen what the admin can do. We need all the help we can get. But her? Really? Do you have any other ex-admins in your inventory? No. Hey, Zara's not the admin. If it goes bad, we can handle her. That's a big gamble. Yeah, I don't know about that. Romeo did always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Ah, run! Yep. We're heading. Seriously, what's with these monsters? They're all glowing! Scary looking, Jesse. Let's be scarier. Yes? Oh, come on, not the llama! 
Just let me think! Think or make something up. Ah! It's fine. Even if there's a setback, we can still get out of this. Not exactly a vote of confidence, but I'll take it. Wait. We can just build to the top of the wall and get to the other side that way. Yeah! Sounds good to me.
point. was unbelievable and you stuck the landing nice oh that it's just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory well there it is guys our ticket out of here that is sparkly the sparkliest is that diamond <laughs> where is everyone that lunatic is gonna be inventory if she's not careful so we should lend her a hand shouldn't we but she sounds like she's in trouble. We need to worry about ourselves, Petra. I'm not letting another admin get its claws on anybody. Plus, the tower is right there. She's the one who ran off on her. She can find her own way to the tower. We're leaving. There's no time. We gotta go. Man, cold-blooded! It'll be better this way, Jesse. Yeah, much safer. Going somewhere? Ah! Where did you just come from? Tarnation! It's the llama thing all over again! I just came from filling a ghast full of arrows. No thanks to you people. Okay, great. We're all together again. Let's keep moving. You were gonna leave me behind. Not very kind of you. I need you to trust me, Jesse. If we're gonna work together... You gotta earn my trust, Zara. So far, you've acted way too crazy for me to trust you. If you'd been through what I've been through, you'd act just as crazy. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Where is he? Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. Uh, where's the rest of it? Yeah, how are we supposed to escape? This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up. We're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go. Below the bedrock. Everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing. And also certain death. <sighs> we're not at the bottom of the world. It only appears that way. I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. That's crazy talk. All those monsters... I don't care! She's an admin. An admin killed Voss, then stole his identity, and then... Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. See? I told you! These stairs lead to our salvation! Now there's a good reason to get a move on.